my service, I manage our hospital social work teams who are very obviously involved in uh, discharging people from hospitals. So I've got four very big, busy teams, primarily qualified social workers, and also some assistant care managers who work in those teams who support people being discharged from hospital. And then and um, once people have been discharged from hospital, we move people into kind of temporary care arrangements after hospital, and then they will go out and do assessments and make longer term arrangements for people after their period of time in hospital, if they need longer term care. Wherever possible, we try and um, work with people with a kind of a rehab and reablement approach so that people don't need long term services. And we kind of try and support people to maintain their independence as long as possible. So it's very very big ethos with our teams and our services. It's around promoting independence. We've got quite a, a, an elderly, frail population in West Sussex, particularly along the coast. So there are huge numbers of people we work with who do need that little bit of extra support to either um, manage in their own homes or actually sometimes need to um, move into a care home longer term to be supported in their sort of later years. So my teams will support all of that and help make those arrangements. So we have the hospital social work side of the service. And the other big part of my services is our combined placement and sourcing team. Now, this is a service we brought together, really a part of it was a very rapid response to the COVID pandemic in March 2020. And the team has um, two main areas. So we do, uh, the team actually makes the arrangements for people's care and support that they need either to live at home or to help people uh, find a care home placement if that's what they need. So this team is all about the kind of sourcing and brokerage function. So some of that is looking for care homes, some of that is making arrangements for people to have support in their own home. Some of that is around longer term care and support. And then we also have a team that works primarily with uh, people being discharged from hospital where we make short term arrangements for people to be discharged from hospital with the care and support that they need immediately after they stay in hospital. And then my social work teams will come out and do an assessments and help um, work with people to put in place whatever they might need longer term. That part of the team particularly was put together as a response to the COVID pandemic. It's a really lovely team, work incredibly hard. It, it, it is really busy, busy work. Um, I'm incredibly proud of what they've achieved over the last 18 months or so. We did a really, really good response in West Sussex to the COVID pandemic and managed to keep our hospitals operating safely.